start the iron a smelting in there. Probably gonna need to add some more wood in there. I don't know if I have enough. But anyway, now we're gonna cook some meat and some more meat. Oh, more meat. More <laughs> Sorry. And oh, there's so much stuff to do. Like when you come back from an adventure. <laughs> There's always so much to do. Oh yeah, there's my steel. Yeah, I got my steel block back. Yippee. We're gonna s just gonna smelt this into here. And this is for me to make a compass. And compasses are useful. They are s totally useful. They make sure you do not get lost if you adventure. Of course, they don't. they totally don't prevent you from screwing yourself up when you spawn. Well, no, they they guide you back to your spawn. So, yeah. That'll point me there, and I should probably make a hut where my spawn is. That would be cool. Could shelter out the night if I ever die or something. Though I usually just run like a madman back to my fort. Which I guess isn't that bad of a course of action, but you know, there are, there are better ways. And there are some things that I totally need to do. And a couple of them are eat this meat and this meat. <laughs> Which brings me back to full health. And another of them Wuv um, what another another of wuv them. <laughs> no, sorry. Another of them is to build me my cobblestone generator. Dun dun dun. Now you know I've seen, so far, two total cobblestone generator accidents. Both me and my friend Jimaka have had cobblestone generator accidents. And in both cases, we burnt down at least one room in our house. Now, I don't know how flammable dirt is, but I don't want to take any chances. Therefore, I am going to build out in this direction my cobblestone generator and man and totally I don't want to fall off here so I gotta well sne sneaking is being very helpful in here but I'm building a little bit outward a little bit outward only a little bit. Well, more than a little bit, but whatever. And, yeah. Now we're gonna build some out this way. And this cobblestone generator is actually probably gonna be pretty high tech when I finish it. Cuz... I've actually got a neat plan. I've got a plan to drop lava onto some water and have it sort of well y you'll see you'll see but anyway we are out here and we are building our cobblestone generator and I must not miss the sneak button because that would be catastrophic <laughs> yeah falling off falling off right now would not be a good experience and I totally ran out of cobblestone well, that's just great. <laughs> oh man, I totally just ran out of cobblestone making my cobblestone generator. <laughs> oh, no I didn't. <laughs> well, it looks like I don't even need a cobblestone generator. Oh well. However, they can be useful. Uh, I guess. Actually, it's mostly just for the purpose of having a cobblestone generator than anything else. But anyway, it's 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 fun. So, the goal here, the goal here, is to start off with some steps, and I want to get at least two blocks above. Well, that did nothing. Um, so I want to build two up with the ever annoying stairs 
However, in this case, they won't annoy me because you know stairs are pretty benign when you aren't when you're not trying to build other stairs near them. Okay, and we're basically gonna build a containing area over here. I don't even need sneaking for this. Anyway, our general goal here in doing this. Oh my gosh, I just had an awesome idea. Again. <laughs> oh, I totally just had a flash of insight of as to how I was going to do the collector for the cobblestone generator. Now, the whole point of this cobblestone generator is implementing a collector. And that is something that will collect my cobblestone for me. And to create my awesome seeming collector, or whatever, I'm going to knock a hole right there. And we're going to use this to sort of, well, you'll see. But anyway, we're going to take our water. We're going to put our water here. And see, the water flows. It flows out there. And that wouldn't be anything really special, except, as you'll see in a moment here, we should probably do a little bit of this with different blocks, just to know which ones are the cobblestone I'm har- well, actually, the cobblestone I'm harvesting is probably going to be landing a little bit higher than this. So now, we need to create the sort of generating portal. So we are going to have the water coming from up there. And we will start it off with the lava in our bank over here. <laughs> yeah, I actually need that now. But we're going to start it off. And see how this works with the lava up there. Now, oh, dang it. That was what I was hoping wouldn't happen. Now, you see this? It's pouring down. So I gotta fix that. And, yeah. Okay. So now, if I knock this, dang it, fail, okay, fail again, um, yeah, stairs, oh, cool, I can use this as an incinerator too, yeah, I just keep coming up with these random ideas. And please let me mine you. I need to... Come on, there we go. Don't turn, thank you. Yeah, I'm talking, talking to the stair block there. But anyway. Okay, so... This is, this is the hard part. Oh no. Our water just got eaten. Got eaten alive in there. Okay, well. We're gonna have to reclaim this lava block. And. Or no, the lava just. The water just got blocked off, really. So we're gonna have to. Yeah, my cobblestone generator is already, already at negative two. <laughs> Negative two productivity. Well, anyway, I need to go collect some water. Wow! Look at all the farm animals up here. Oh man, they must be having a hoot just 
generating animals on top of my base. Oh man. That's just fun. Fun to come back and see a whole million animals milling about in your base. They're swimming in my infinite spring. How lovely. <laughs> oh man. Okay, well, let, let's fix this. Let's fix these. This silliness. Okay. Now, you see what's happen happening to the cobblestone there? It's being pushed. And that's what I'm trying to harness here. I'm trying to harness the ability of cobblestone to be pu er, stuff generally, just to be pushed down a stream. Now if we lay some more water, it, oh, it's, it's not working very well. I guess I'm just going to need to keep running back and forth and grabbing a ton of water. But the animals are escaping, no! I actually want to keep them bottled up in here. Don't you think that'd be awesome? Just having a farm? You know, I guess they can't really escape, because they're not going to jump off a cliff on purpose. At least I don't think they would. I mean, they're not programmed to be stupid or anything. But, yeah. Okay. So the point of this generator is pointy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. We're gonna try this. Okay, so there's part of the generator, and then we have this here. And then we mine this block. And then we just get it. And the point is, the block is supposed to be flowing. Okay, well, my cobblestone generator is a bit of a... <laughs> well, my awesome cobblestone generator idea is a bit of a bust here. Actually, if we recollect this source block, they'll start flowing again. Okay, so this is actually working fairly well. And you see what they're doing? They're all pouring out the side of my base. Which would be somewhat pointless. Hey, yay! Uh, which would be somewhat pointless, except... Oh! Ooh, look at that! That's cool. Uh, but anyway, it would be somewhat pointless unless I did something like this. And we'll just judge where that is, okay. Oh, I almost ran off the edge of my base! That sucks. Okay. And I might redecorate this and make it more awesome sometime. However, ooh, it's being cool. <laughs> okay, would you look at that? There is my cobblestone collection area. And I know this could look a lot cooler, but it totally doesn't, and I'm completely okay with that. <laughs>